Hi, I'm Nick DiLorenzo and I'm with Horizon Distributors. And today we're going to talk about fertilizer spreader calibration. How many guys from your staff actually know how to calibrate a fertilizer spreader properly? Today we're going to go over the one, two, three steps to accurately do that so you know exactly how much fertilizer you're putting out. So you don't have to reorder because you over applied or have a lot of fertilizer left over because you under applied. So what do we need to get started? We need a fertilizer spreader. We need to know the effective width of the fertilizer spreader, which means how wide it throws the fertilizer. The next thing after that is we need a scale. We need to be able to measure the material as we put it out. The third thing we need is a calibration tray, a broom, or a bucket, because we have to capture the material we put out and make sure that we put the right amount out. Okay, so the math. Your contract states you need to use one pound of nitrogen per thousand square feet of this turf row 2429. So you take the one known pound of nitrogen that you need and you're going to divide it by the analysis in this bag as a decimal to give you 4.16 pounds of total fertilizer to get one pound of nitrogen per thousand. Let's go outside and I'll show you. So here's the area that we're working in. It's 100 feet long by 10 feet since that's the effective width for a total of 1,000 square feet. Here's the fertilizer spreader that we're going to be using. Here's the scale that we're going to use to measure the fertilizer material in. And here is the bucket. Okay, knowing from doing our math inside, we need 4.16 pounds of product to equal one pound of nitrogen. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill this bucket with 10 pounds of product and we're going to go calibrate using this 10 pounds. So I'm going to put it in this bucket, I'm going to weigh it out on the scale, and then I'm going to dump it into the fertilizer spreader and then I'm going to go walk that 100 feet. Okay, so we're done spreading it. Now we need to find out how much is left. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to dump this back in the bucket on the scale and we're going to measure what's left we started with 10 pounds, there's 6 pounds left, we put out 4 pounds. Alright, so there you go. In 5 minutes we learned how to calibrate a fertilizer spreader. It's that easy. So remember, you got to do the math first, and then you got to come out into the field and do the legwork. But, in 5 minutes you too can know exactly how much product you need to apply and make sure you're applying that right amount of product. Thanks for visiting us today. If you have any questions, please call one of our local Horizon branches or visit us on www.horizononline.com. Have a great day.